हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू शॉर्ट ऑफ क्लासेस वेलकम टू शॉर्ट ऑफ सर्स क्लासेस इन आर टूडेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस सम पास्ट ईयर क्वेश्चंस सम पास्ट ईयर क्वेश्चंस फ्रॉम वेरी फेमस एंड वेरी प्रेस्टिजियस आईआईटी जैम geology paper so this is a video on geology a very demanding subject nowadays a very high rated subject uh, a lot of students are appearing for this subject not only in iit gem but in other courses as well because this is in market demand in nowadays hot favorite course one of the hot favorite course nowadays so this video is very important for all the aspirants of iit gem geology who are going to appear for this exam in the coming years that is in 2020 2021 22 and in the coming years as well because in this video you will be getting a lot of new things you will be knowing a lot of new things uh, uh, many of you have started preparing for iit jam geology but you don't know that what sort of questions come in exam and what are the type of questions or a lot of things are going on in your mind that how to you know how to crack the question how to deal with it you know how to what to study what not to study and uh, how to manage your time in the examination hall so in this video everything will be given to you so in this video you will be getting an idea about the type of questions which are going to come in the exam so this is very important because uh, it will make you accustomed to the type of questions and it will it will make you more and more you know uh, familiar to the questions which are going to come in the exam and you will not be in you know uh, any kind of uh, adverse situation in the examination hall because you will be uh, you will be getting those questions in uh, which is very familiar to you so this is very important to know the type of questions and the most important thing after the type of questions is how to crack the questions so you have to crack the questions and you have to select the correct options since it's a mcq type question so you have to select the correct option and the best thing about mcq is that options are four and among those four any one is correct and that one correct answer is before your eyes so it's very easy to select that particular option just you have to have a some proper concept and uh, you have to just uh, uh, crack it okay so it's not a hard nut to crack but uh, it needs a lot of practice uh, so in this video Uh, we'll be giving you past year questions, uh, discussing past year questions with you. So I have prepared some, assembled some questions from past years which are which are of standard quality, and so that I can teach it, teach you all these. And uh, in this video, I'll not be getting any no hints or suggestions or the just uh, the correct options of the questions. Rather, we'll give you the full solution of this, full solution, complete solution will be provided to you of every question. We'll give you complete solution. with step by step explanation so this is also to be noted over here that we'll give you step by step explanations as as well step by step explanations will be given to you along with some theories we'll discuss some theories as well which are important and suppose uh, there is a question and uh, it is a long question and it needs to be you know it needs to discuss it needs to be discuss some theories about about that particular question so we'll discuss the theories in that cases as well and uh, we will uh, take a diagrammatic approach of every question we will take a diagrammatic approach so diagrammatic approach or you can say that uh, diagrammatic representation will be given to you so that you can understand the thing more clearly diagrams are very important because it will make your concepts more and more clear because our main objective is to clear your concepts okay this that is very important for any competitive examination okay it will make you different from other candidates okay so you have to be perfect in your diagrammatic ideas and uh, we will give you some tips and tricks and uh, some uh, time management techniques as well that how to manage your times in examination hall so that you can complete the entire paper within the given amount of time so that's it and let's move to the question and see that what type of question is giving is given over there and what is the question so let's read the question first for well, the question is host and graben structures are typically formed by normal faulting strike slip faulting reverse faulting or is it thrust faulting so 
four options has been given to you and the important thing which we need to discuss over here is Horst and Graben. So what is Horst and Graben? So in geology, Horst and Graben refers to Horst and Graben it refers to regions that lie between normal faults between normal faults and e and are either and are either higher or lower higher or lower than the area beyond the fault than the area beyond the fault okay so let's uh, draw some diagram so that you can understand this thing more clearly okay so let me draw a diagram for you a very simplified diagram I will give you a very simplified diagram so that you can understand it more clearly okay so let me draw a diagram diagram is very important because uh, if you have clear concept about the diagram then you can you will be able to handle all the sort all sort of questions quite easily and it uh, will not be more difficult for you to understand the, the thing understand the question okay so be very very confident about the diagrams which you are drawing and be very strong about that okay so, you know being strong in diagram will help you get uh, huge amount of marks although it's mcq type of question but uh, if you have the good uh, you know structure of uh, idea about the diagram then it will help help you a lot okay uh, keep this thing in mind keep my uh, you know words okay so uh, slowly and steadily we are proceeding in the diagram and i hope that you are understanding that what am i what am i drawing over here So once my diagram is complete then you will be able to find out that what I have I drawn over here okay this thing is here and so this is a host and graven diagram okay so this thing are the horse the bulky part over here and the part which is a you know kind of depressed between the two horse is like the gravel the water comes from here to here you no know, it falls from here to here like this now so it, these are found when normal falls are opposite the occurring pair which parallel strike uh, you know lines horse and gravel are always formed together they are always together okay gravel are usually represented by low no low lying areas such as rifts and river valleys look where this cabin found the low lying areas like rifts river valleys rifts river, river valleys and uh, you know where horst are represent the ridges horst represent the ridges between or on either side of these valleys in geology it refers to the normal falls either higher or lower a horse represent a block pushed upward relative to the block on the other side by faulting so this phenomenon is occurred due to faulting okay graben is a block generally long compared to its width that has been lowered relative to the blocks at the side due to faulting horse and graben are formed when normal faults opposite dip occur in pair with parallel strike lines okay with parallel strike lines so this is the structure of graben and, and horse a very nice structure and if you have you know it's a kind of three dimensional structure which i have tried to draw over here and uh, the question which we have that uh, how, how you know form it is from normal faulting so, you know the strike slip faulting reverse faulting or thrust faulting so after i have discussed the things you all have you all must have understood that what is the correct answer to this question is it strike slip faulting no is it thrust faulting not again it is reverse faulting not at all the correct option is normal faulting because this is happened due to normal faulting okay so the correct option to this question is normal faulting so we can write that option a is correct 
the right answer is option A. Well, uh, that's it for today's video. We have discussed a very important question about horse and cabin, and I hope that you all understood this uh, video. But still, if you have any kind of doubts or any kind of queries, and if you want to ask anything, then feel free to call us or WhatsApp us anytime. Our number is. Nine eight three six seven nine three zero seven six, or you can visit our website www dot sort of classes dot com, and you can get further information regarding our classes. And uh, for watching this video, a lot of thanks from my side. Thank you, students. Thanks a lot.